Close your eyes, watch your breath, all the way in, all the way out. Try to stay right here. You don't have to go anywhere else right now. Nothing else you have to do, nothing else you have to think about. Just look at the breath, look at the mind. Because everything you experience in the body, you experience through the breath. And experience, everything you experience through the, the world goes through the mind. There are many layers before it gets to you. Things make contact at the eyes, the ears, nose, tongue, body. And then word gets passed along. And finally it gets to the control center to decide what to do. And then it sends its orders out. The problem is sometimes that whispering that brings news of the world outside coming in is a whispering campaign. And it's whispering all kinds of false information. Things get filtered in a way that's not necessarily good. Sometimes the filter of the mind gets clogged. Good things don't get let in and bad things do get let in. So you've got to clean out the filter. You do that by getting the mind really still so it can see itself clearly. Because when the mind doesn't know itself, then it can do all kinds of mischief, not only to the world outside, but more importantly to its, to its own happiness. It's like having different people in there with different ideas of what your happiness would be. Some of them have very narrow ideas, some of them have very small-minded ideas. We've got to clean them out because they're going to be filtering things all in the wrong way. So clean out the filters. Breathe through the body, breathe through everything. Every pattern of tension, every pattern of tightness in the body, just breathe right through it so that you're happy to be right here. It feels good to be right here. And then when you're right here, you can see what's going on. You can check all the filters, both the things that filter the things coming in and the filters that things, filter things going out. Because sometimes, of course, there are things you want to do, but you realize they're not right. But again, if that filter gets clogged, you end up doing and saying things you're later going to regret. So keep your filters clean as you go through the meditation and try to keep them as clean as you can as you go through the day. It's when you keep watch over them that they stay open. It's when you forget about them and get, let your attention go someplace else. And you're not paying attention to how you're filtering the information that's coming in from outside. The filters are bound to get clogged again. So pay attention inside, because that's where a lot of the misunderstandings of the world come from. And of course there is wrong information that's being fed to us from outside. But what's even worse is the wrong information that the mind adds to things because of its own likes and dislikes, ideas is picked up from who knows when, a long time ago. Really old crud in your filters. So clean them out. You'll benefit, you'll get a better sense of what's really going on. The information you bring in will be a lot more useful. And then the things you decide to do will be more firmly based, more truly in your real self-interest. And self-interest is the kind of happiness that causes no harm to anyone. That's when you've used your filters well, looked after them well. They've served their purpose.